Hello, good day everyone. So I've been well since making of this video tutorial. So I would like to share now uh, uh, my tutorial about mapping old palm cover you know, and also old palm cover change. As you know, uh, old palm is a uh, is a plant, uh, tropical palm for its oil. So people uh, plant it and use it for oil. So it's very big and famous. Uh, used a lot, uh, planted a lot in Indonesia, especially in Kalimantan and uh sumatra i mean if you just open google maps you know in satellite mode you can easily find all palm as big as this you know this is all palm basically this town of this so yeah it's covering a lot of part of indonesia uh it's very uh useful for exporting and also as a but yeah of course for cooking oil that's a big part of it so i'd like to share basically uh, how to map it you know and with uh, with the thing with Sentinel One, uh, the one that I use, the image I use is that they can capture uh, oil palm uh, quite good enough. And first of all, that I use is Sentinel One RTC, which is uh, provided by planetary computer uh, from Microsoft. Uh, so basically, Sentinel One that already uh, corrected for its rain, you know, so you don't have this kind of effect from the mountain, you know, from the edges, you know, from the slope. Uh, basically, it minimizes the different effect. Okay. I'm using resolution of 30 meters, so instead of 10, so we can just use lower resolution to, uh, you know, to decrease the RAM, you know, the memory usages. You know. And of course, the band is the same, 50 and VH. And for the year for analysis, I use 2020, 2020 and 2024. Uh, so yeah, basically, if you put the region that you choose is Santa Kalimantan Georges uh, area, uh, you can choose your own area. But uh, I think I just saw it, give you the example on my script. Uh, at least in my repository, you can just check it. And then what you do is that uh, I show you where it's located, which is uh, like above here, I think. Oh, it's in the south. I think it's about this region. Uh, I already created a script basically to get the Sentinel One images from the uh, planetary computer catalog. So you can just rest easy. Just change your region of interest, then you can just capture the same images. So yeah, I already generated the images. Uh, you can just run your own, your own on your time. So what I did is that uh, first I to visualize the results. You know, I'm using a composite of fifty VH and FVI. What's FVI? It's just a, a formula. It's not much different between the VH and VH band. And um, I show it on the map. You can see that uh, at least in the one, you can identify it, uh, the oil pump very clearly with uh, pink pink color. At least with my composite, you know. And this thing will be the source of our mapping. Okay, continue. Uh, so how how do we map all palm cover? Well, first, uh, what I do is that I create a segment. Uh, wh why do we create a segment? Uh, well, I need to make sure that uh, the region that is seen on these small patches is, is not considered, so we just ignore it. So if we focus on the bigger area. So just generalize it as much as possible. So if the all palm just one plan, uh, it's not, we're not gonna care of it. But if there is like big a plan or you know, big plots, we're gonna care of it. So how we map it? Uh, so from the segmented RVI, uh, we're gonna select the, the value below six thousand seven hundred fifty. Uh, or if it, it is, uh, I mean, this value already multiplied by one uh, ten thousand. So yeah. And also, it's the value of segment VH is below seven fifty. Why this number? Uh, because uh, at least in our case, my cases, this value is uh, the most matches at least in our region, and it is all palm. I mean, you could change the value to fit your needed, and you know, I just resolve basically. But yeah, you could use this value as a beginning, then try to change it a bit later, and see which best. And this is the result. This that's my one. Uh, you can see this more grouped, more group is if. Instead of just if we are not uh, if segmentation, you can see a lot of change of oil pump, especially on the north part here, compared to the next year. You know, so there's ton of changes. You know, and it, this will be captured. And from this result, I also save it. You know, as a, a raster and also as GeoJSON, if you like it. So yeah, save a raster here, save a GeoJSON here. So let's see if we plot in QGIS. So how does it look? I already uh, uh, give it to uh, already save it. Uh, I will just show you basically the QGIS part. Yeah, wait a second. How do I change it? Ah, here, here it. Um, okay, here we go. This is the QGIS. Uh, you can see that for 2020, this is the cover. So the north part here and on. I mean, you can see that the background images is not. <laughs> I mean, another year is so we just as background. 
and this is the 2022 with the changes and 2024. So you get the old pump cover. I mean, you can do it for the whole of Kalimantan as far as I know. Just check that if uh, if it's covering the region you wanted. As you can see that this area, which is some, some mining, is not considered. So only the oil pump part, so this this important part. And maybe, I mean, it's not considered oil pump because well, it's the growth a bit. So yeah, this is the oil pump. Uh, so what you can also do is that, uh, not only that maybe oil pump, that I want to show you that you can also map the oil pump changes. So back to the script. Uh, I made a script here basically to make a uh, oil pump cover change. So if it's, there's none oil pump forever there, so it's, I assume value zero, and it's oil pump there, but not anymore. In 2024, it's one value, and then it's uh, not oil pump, but now it's oil, it's oil pump, it's two, so new oil pump. This is the plot that I show you. So you can see that the green one show the lost one, so it's no longer oil pump there, and yellow one is the new oil pump, you know, from this region. Then also the same, I also save it as QJSON, you know and as it's raster if you're interested so both value is fine and this oil pump uh, cover area is not changing that much i guess <laughs> because there's addition and loss too so yeah <laughs> you need to uh maybe use a longer year but again it's not one available that long i guess so yeah this is the oil pump cover change uh as you can see that <laughs> so this region is the one that's gone so no longer the pump here at least based on the data but not the satellite data, I mean, this is data we don't know when it is. And there is this new one here on the north. So this new old pump, but not before. So yeah, so this is the different, I guess. You can use it, you can try the method. I mean, you can improve it, obviously. Uh, you can see that psh, this old pump, uh, an improvement and it's work, at least in my, this region that we show inside of Kalimantan. But if you have any option, you can uh, make it much better. So yeah, that's uh, the... That's, uh, that's all thumb, I'll say. Oh yeah, have you see the change? Yeah, this is, I think I forgot to change it through with this. Uh, <laughs> this is the QGIS, uh, the one I show you, this should be there. So yeah, this is the all palm, um, all palm, uh, script mapping all palm, and also the, uh, you can just try it, or, uh, just kind of post story, listen the all palm part, and try yourself in, in Jupyter Notebook. I guess that's it about my videos. Uh, Thank you for this and good day.